Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Taylor Sierra. Y'all like my little sweater? I think it's really cute. It looks like a little sheep or something, but it's really cute. I love it. It's real like I'm here, bitch. You know, that's how it is. So yes, thank you guys for tuning in to my video. Of course, if you have not watched my last video, like make sure you go check it out right now because what? Like, it's a really good video. So if you did watch my last video, then you know that I did a quick weave with the closure. And I told y'all in the description that I was going to give y'all the background on this hair because, girl... Okay, so let me tell y'all originally why I was getting the hair and all this. So, at first, like, I really had my mindset. I was like, no, I'm using either one of those vendors. But then I was like, mm, let me try something new so that I can do a review for y'all and put y'all on to the new hair, right? So, I wanted straight hair. I didn't want any curly, wavy, nothing. I just wanted straight extensions. So, I'm like, okay, let me go on AliExpress and see what I can find. So, I found this um, hair vendor. I think they were called Safari Hair or something. If that's not what it's called, you know, I'll put it down below, of course. So, I was like, all right, they got some reviews. You know, people like, oh, I love this hair, this and that. Da, da, da. So, I'm like let's try it out i mean you know it's always a hit or miss on aliexpress anyways so they sent the hair and i first of all before i even opened the package i was like this is kind of light to be some bundles you know like this is a little too light mind y'all i think i got the inches i was looking at was t straight 20 inches with the 18 inch closure or all 22 inches with the 20 inch closure so i was looking at either one of those yeah i said that right i just had to make sure so i was looking for either one of those for a good price you know so i'm just like okay like they got good reviews like people saying they really like it and they had a good time with this hair and it lasts that blah 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 whatever so you know like i said i got it and i was just like oh my gosh like this package is so light you know some bundles are usually heavy and mind you it's only a 20 inch or it's only 22 no i found 20 inches that's what i ended up getting essentially so i ended up getting 20 inches period so i'm like okay you know so i'm opening the bag and i'm just like oh my gosh like this is not it i don't know girl i'll take the hair out the pack can you say thin mind you it's 20 inches okay i know the longer you go the thinner your bundles is gonna be but it's not like i was getting a 30 inch i had 20 now i've ordered from aliexpress plenty of times even with the beauty of hair i had 18 20 22 was it something like that and it was thick like it wasn't thin at all i was able to achieve a hairstyle with two and a half bundles so i'm just like I'm really examining this hair, y'all. I'm like, this is just, like, too thin for me. I don't like it. So I reached out to the vendor, and I was telling her, like, you know, this hair is kind of thin for it to be a 20-inch. She's like, you know, the longer you go, blah, 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 whatever. I already know that. But at this point, like, no, this is not one of those cases. It's just, like, these bundles are really skimpy. So I was just like, you know what? I'm going to send it back, and um, I'll just get a refund because I knew that I couldn't do anything with that hair. Like, even if I use all three bundles, it still wasn't going to be enough to complete a full look you know like it was gonna be super thin i don't do super thin wigs sew-ins none of that i don't like that so i send it back to them you know i got the refund so then y'all check this out so i went to zzy fashion i was like okay since i gave a good review on their loose deep way i'm gonna just go ahead and order their straight hair like i mean i did look at the reviews and they did you know say oh this hair is good blah, blah, blah. you know you get your money's worth blah, blah, blah. So, I'm like, okay, I'm going to just go ahead. I already know ZZY ain't going to do me dirty. You know what I'm saying? This is going to be a guaranteed look right here. I already know. So, I go ahead and I order it. Excuse me, I thought I had a burp. So, I was leaving on a Thursday. And I didn't start creating the wig until Monday or Tuesday. So, at this point, it's really crunch time. Mind y'all, I still have to work during the week. I am usually get off late. So, I'm just like, I'm really pressed for time. But I'm still going to do this because I'm going to Vegas. Like... I gotta look good in Vegas, period, you know? <laughs> so, uh, it was like, uh, okay, so when I got these bundles, y'all, <laughs> these bundles were thin, too. I was like, oh, my God, this was kind of thin. Once again, I'm getting straight here, and this is the second vendor I had. And I'm just like, at this point, I can't even afford to send the hair back and then order some more hair. It's Monday or Tuesday, and I leave on Thursday. 
So, mind you, my hair needs to be done by Thursday, by Wednesday night, really, because I'm leaving Thursday. So, I'm just like, oh, my God, what am I going to do? So, I'm just like, whatever. I'm going to just go ahead and just make this wig. And hopefully, when I put all three bundles together, it's going to be full. So, girl, let me show y'all some videos of how this hair was because it was just like, so this happened on the 24th. Yes. And you were out for the evening. Just for the evening. And you did not anticipate that somebody else was going to be in your room. No. So everything that you had in the room you anticipated would be there when you got back. That's correct. You went through all your stuff and you realized a whole bunch of stuff was missing. Cash, jewelry. So yeah, as y'all can see, like, that hair was... Thin, honey and that was three bundles mind y'all mind y'all keep this in mind i had some old hair that i had and i was just like you know what actually it was a loose deep wave wig i had to use some of that hair because i was just like you know what mm -mm, this ain't gonna work like this is too thin so i even used some of my own hair y'all and it still came out to look like that it was so thin and i was just like the, the thing about it is i added so much hair to it like i was sewing the tracks close together and everything and it was really, like, full at the top. Like, it was so full. Like, it was, like, hella hair, basically. Because <laughs> I sewed it so close together. Or I'm doubling the tracks trying to get it to, you know, make it look thick. So, it's like, hella hair up here. And then when you get down, it was, like, two tracks. And I'm just like, what the hell? Even when I added my own bundle. So, I'm just like, okay, I don't really, this, this ain't going to work. So, what am I going to do? So, I was just like, whatever. I went to sleep. It was late. So, I went to sleep and I went to work the next day, whatever. So, all while I'm at work, y'all, I'm literally thinking, like, what am I about to do with my hair? I don't want to go short because I could have always, you know, went to the beauty supply and got a 10-inch, 12-inch. I do that sometimes. But I'm like, no, it's my birthday and I'm going to Vegas. I'm trying to, you know what I'm saying? I want some bundles. I want some inches. Like, but anyway, so I went to the beauty supply store, right? So the bundles that I had were 20 inches long. So I'm like, I have to basically either get an 18 or a 20. Like, it's no 14, 16. Like, that's not going to be long enough. So I went to the beauty supply store. I got an 18-inch. I'm sorry I'm looking around, but I'm thinking, like, playing this back in my head. So I got an 18-inch, and that was, like, $64. And I was just like, ooh, I was so irritated. And I was like, at this point, like, I have to do this because I have to make my wig, you know, like, I got to get right for Vegas. That's all I'm thinking. Vegas, 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 Vegas. So I got to do what I got to do right. Okay, so I buy that and then I get home. So I was like, okay, I'm going to just make a wig, but I'm a gooey. I'm not going to sew it because it's so time consuming. It takes so freaking long, y'all. So I made a quick weave um, wig with the glue. And so, I started at the very, very bottom. If y'all watch my videos, y'all know that. I always start my hair at the very... When I say at the nape, it's at the nape. So, I would start at the nape, right? ZZY Fashion Track. Then I put another one right on top, ZZY Fashion. Then I would go in with a Dreamweaver, put that on, go in with another Dreamweaver, glue that on, and then go back in with the ZZY Fashion and do it all over again. So, I guess I kind of did have a technique. I just did that so... That the Dreamweaver could add the fullness to it. Because that's what it was lacking. It had the length. It just didn't have the fullness. So I did that. And then once I got to the top, I started to double um, a little bit of my Dreamweaver as well. Now, you know that when you go to the beauty supply store, it's the same. The longer you go, the less hair you get. So I was like, okay. At one point, I stopped using it all in the middle. The freak. I know I just look cross eyed. At least I thought I did. <laughs> I felt like it. So, anyways, um, I stopped um putting the two tracks with the dreamer because I'm like I'm running out of hair. Like you really don't get that much hair. You get enough to make it work. So I'm just like okay. I'm just going to start um still doing the double tracks with the ZZY fashion and then going in and putting another ZZY fashion track on because at this point I had three bundles so I needed to use all of those and then once I did use the Dreamweaver again I started doubling that to give it fullness so I'm just like this is so crazy I don't know how this wig is gonna turn out at this point like it has to turn out right like that's the only option because I am leaving so then I finally finished I, you know I put the closure on like I said if y'all watched my last video then y'all saw the unit already so I'm just like like, oh my gosh, like, I need to try this wig on because I don't know how it's going to look. It looks like it's getting full, but I need to see how it's going to look on. Is it going to be super full, full like I like it? Like I said, I'm used to, um, bleh. I'm used to full bundles. I'm not used to thin bundles. I don't like thin hair. It's just not 
That's not what I like. So I'm just like, okay, like, let me just try this wig on, right? So I'm going to insert some pictures or videos so y'all can see how So I was just like, man, I should have just ordered the Vediva hair bundles from the beginning and I probably wouldn't even be in this situation. So at this point, I was just spending money. Like I had already spent like $90 twice, got a refund for one, and then I went and spent $64. So really, I could have just spent a hundred and some dollars and got what I needed to have the first time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so that's what I always say. Like AliExpress is literally a hit or miss. Like... I don't want people to think that I always hit with AliExpress and I'm just always finding a good hair because that is not the case. So basically, you guys, you just have to know how to work your situation. And that's why I always um, stress to do not throw away your old bundles because you never know when you're going to need them. Like seriously, you never, 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 never know when you're going to need those bundles. Even if you just need a couple of pieces of hair, a couple of tracks, you know, if you're doing a leave out, you might need couple pieces for you leave out like you just never know so i do not throw out my old bundles at all even old wigs that i made okay y'all so i'm gonna show y'all the unit right now today now listen <laughs> i have not flat ironed it i have not done anything to it so this is the closure oh that looks good and so this is how the hair is looking so i feel like this hair actually looks good honestly I told y'all it ain't been flat iron. <laughs> I feel like this unit actually looks good though. Like the hair is, it looks good. That is my story on my Bad AliExpress um, experience. I couldn't think of the word. <laughs> so my Bad AliExpress experience. And it really wasn't too, too bad. But it was bad enough. You know, I don't care how much money it is. You're going to expect a decent product. You know, even if it's a synthetic wig and it's $20, you're still expecting your unit or that hair to be of some quality, at least for like a week or so. Well, that's what's synthetic. But if you get in like ZZY fashion hair, first of all, I'm expecting this hair to at least last me a month, two or three months. Because like I said, depending on how you take care of it, it definitely can last. So you all be careful when you are ordering from these hair vendors. Just know that sometimes it might not go as planned. Know that sometimes you might have to just freak your situation and get it. And just just work it out, you know, because that's exactly what I had to do. I had to work it out or I was going to be ass out. So, you know, I just had to figure it out. And so that's basically what you're going to have to do, figure it out. So, no, I don't recommend this hair. No, don't buy the straight hair. I would rather you go to the beauty supply store and get two packs of Dreamweaver. You will be better off, okay? That's my honest opinion about it. I'm not going to lie. I never lied on any hair of you. Y'all know. If I think it's good, I'm going to let y'all know. But that... Mm -mm. So, yes, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video on this unit, even though, you know, she not pressed out or anything. She just, you know, she out here a little bit, a little bit. So, so if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, I mean, reach out. That's why I'm here. I don't mind talking to you guys. I actually love when y'all comment on my videos. <laughs> so, yeah, you guys, make sure you go ahead and tune in to all of my other videos because they are good, too. And I will see y'all in my next video. But before we go, let's get into this ponytail. Like, ooh, woo, baby, I did that. Period. <laughs>